good. 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 Come on and have a seat. Come on and have a seat, baby. You can sit right next to me. How are you doing, honey? Finally, you, how you doing? All right, good to see you. Enjoy. <laughs> Those pretty dimples. Come on in, baby, sit down, too. How you doing, sugar? How you doing? I'm doing wonderful, wonderful. She have a play called Christmas in the Never Never Land. Oh wow. And I was trying to her in my finest jacket. Oh yeah. Let me get you out there. There's a lot of uh, uh, hay and uh, straw, you know, you know, that kind of grass out there. You know, and it'll get you out there. Yeah. yeah my, my sinuses are bad. Hey, Billy, one question. What time you didn't play uh, uh, Freddy Cougar? You, you up for that part of her? No, that was all just something. No, so I, that, made up. I was told by Bob in England. Bob in England. He said that you up that goal a while back. I heard that too, but I, I okay. never heard anything about it. I think Billy. Yeah. How you doing, Billy? Good, Good to see you, man. Good to see you, man. Good, man. I wanted to ask something. Uh, a couple things. One thing, more of a gimmicky question here. You're putting your house up for sale, I'm seeing it's all over the news. Is that, is that? They always put that up on there. Yeah. We're, we're thinking about it. Maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What I wanted to know is when you're selling your house or past experiences, do you ever as a celebrity have any weird buyers? Like people that come in wanting to buy it for like, oh my God, I can own Billy Bob Thornton's old house. No, nah, not really. Not really? No. Nah. And then, yeah, like, and then is it, do you find them hard to sell at all or is it kind of an easy buy? We're not trying that hard. We're just, we're kind of taking our time. You know, yeah. teenagers are older. They're going to go get their own place. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. Too much for us now. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Cool. And the other thing I wanted to ask you about was you're obviously very political, and you said I heard you say earlier you were going to be Democrat. I was just curious what you thought about uh, you heard about Romney lying under oath uh, against the uh, the cases in Baltimore right now. Uh, who? Uh, Mitt Romney. He lied oh, under oath. No. He, okay, he's being represented. Yeah, it's this whole thing going on about him lying under oath um, for a, a case, and I just was wondering. You know, as a potential presidential candidate, how you felt about that? Hearing that, do you think that that's something that, like, that'll hurt his chances at all, or do you think that's something that won't necessarily matter? Bye, oh. Billy Bob. Bye, buddy. I'll see you. <laughs> <laughs> all right. I wish I played Monster the ball. Take care, baby. Yeah, I don't, I, I don't know anything about it, so I can't comment on it. Okay. I mean, the fact is, people say a lot of things. Who knows what's true? I wasn't there, so I don't know. Yeah. But, as I said, I've always been a Democrat, so... Yeah. My question would be, for one, beautiful boots, awesome boots. <laughs> oh, thanks, man. And the other one is, now, it's off of politics, it's not off away from all that, but what do you think about most of these new actors and actresses, real people come into this business that are a bit younger, and they go through, you know, addiction and problems, and I know you might have had some past with that, but... I don't want to lose, but I don't know who's going to want it. I really don't. You know, uh, but, uh, yeah, I, I don't know what to do about it. Thank you, Billy. Hey, Thanks, Billy. Thanks, Billy. Hey, 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 Billy.